WQAD. News 8 at 11 starts now. Coming up next on News 8 at 11, increasing numbers. Area senior centers are seeing more and more men move in. The changes they're making to cater to those new residents. Welcome back to News 8 at 11. Senior living facilities are seeing more and more men moving in, and that's changing how they cater to residents. Mike Mickle has more on this week's QC Family Focus Friday. Jack Potter is one of an increasing number of men residing in area senior living facilities. Places like Senior Star and Davenport are focusing on activities for the growing male population. It provides a lot of companionship that you wouldn't get living at home. Jack is helping his fellow senior men keep active. When he moved in nearly four years ago, he brought his train set. I originally had it in the basement of my house, and then when I moved over here, I packed it up and brought it over here. We had to cut it up in order to get it out of the basement. It doesn't take too long to cut it up. It took a long time to put it back together. But we're seeing men begin to live longer and, and again, thus more moving into our community. Um, we've been trying to focus a little bit more on some of the men activities. It's a team effort. Jack laid the track and friends at Senior Star built the houses and other buildings in the growing town. It helps create a sense of community for the men. We had to figure out how we could get it up high enough clear the trains and still make it up the grade. But trains aren't all. Jack spent years as a horticulturist, first in his own business and later at hy -Vee. Well, I kept it quiet for the first year and then I could tell they needed help, so I more or less volunteered. He plants and maintains about 15 of these big pots. There are nearly 10 varieties of annuals. All are scattered across the property. Jack has definitely increased what we do for our landscaping and uh, given us the opportunity to expand what beyond what we would normally be able to do. And obviously he puts the love and the attention into it that, that maybe a, a company wouldn't always put into it. They see that coming and going, so the, yeah, they tell me they appreciate it. Reporting for QC Family Focus Magazine, I'm Mike Mickle. And of course, be sure to pick up the August issue of Family Focus for more great, fun ideas. You can also read it online at qcfamilyfocus.com.